here with Kennesaw State juniors, Markeith Cummings and Ladaire Green. The two of you have been on the same teams going all the way back to ninth grade, first in high school down in Savannah, then at prep school, and now you came here to Kennesaw State together. Um, Ladaire, tell, tell us a little bit about that experience, just having the same teammate all the way through. Uh, it's, it's fun. Uh, you, you begin to uh, learn a lot about the first, the first one. Uh, you become like your brother. Uh, it's everything, you know, become your best friend. And Markeith, uh, you've seen Ladares play now since ninth grade. Yeah. Um, how has his game changed? Is he is he a, a different type of player than he was he's, in high school? Yeah, he's a lot different now. Like he's way aggressive, way more aggressive. And it's like in ninth grade, he came in as like a little stick or whatever. And now he just he get he got a lot of definition into him, and he like banging up up under the goal and stuff more now. He's shooting more, and it's it's real different. Way better than when I first met him. Yeah. Ha has it helped having a guy out on the court that you've had there for for years at a time? Either of you can take yeah, that. It, it helps a lot because it's it's like when you start playing with new people, they have to learn the way you are, or whatever, and the way you play and stuff. But now I have somebody on the court that's been with me for a long time, and he kind of know, and he kind of like tell the other players like, okay, this is what you like to do, this is what you do, this is what you can do, and this is what you can't do. And it seems like I always know where he at on the court. Mm -hmm. Everybody on the ball, I always know where he at. Yeah. Gotcha. Mark Keith, you led the, the Atlantic Sun Conference in scoring last season at 18.3 points per game. Ladaris, you led the league in rebounding, 8.5 rebounds per game, irrespective of the fact that the two of you have been teammates for so long. You've just done so well in the Atlantic Sun Conference. Tell us a little bit about conference play this year and how your past experience is going to help you this year. Um, it's basically, it's going to help us out a, little, uh, a lot, really. And <laughs> And have us more confident. So, but that really, the stats and stuff really don't mean nothing to us or whatever. We're just trying to get wins or whatever and get to the championship. Yeah. Put it together and, and win, the, win these games, especially all these big, game, big games we have, uh, Missouri and whatnot, and beating Belmont this year. And you talked about uh, Missouri, Belmont, a couple of tough opponents. Uh, when you first saw who, who the Owls are facing, who you're facing, uh, the first few weeks of the season, what was your first reaction with Wisconsin on the schedule, with St. Mary's, with Missouri, et cetera? My reaction, I was like, I'm about to be ready <laughs> to come out and play. And, like, this is, what, this is what I'm here for. Yeah. Yeah, so. I love playing big games. I love playing big games. Right. Um, last year had Iowa State and had Creighton, two, two big crowds, two big programs. Um, do you feel like that helped you once you got to the Atlantic Sun Conference play? Yeah, those big games, like those higher level teams or whatever, that, that helps us out a lot because when we come in the conference, it's like we played against all these different teams and we we ready. Yeah, we, we, we yeah. play against the best, you know, might as well win these games. What has the new coaching staff done for the two of you uh, as far as development with theirs? You can start. Has it, has it been a fresh approach? Has it, has it helped your game? Uh, it's, it's a lot better because uh, I got two coaches who uh, play my position, you know, used to play my position, and uh, it showed me uh, what it takes to, uh, to be a big man in the hole, basically. And me, it's the coaches that we have now, they, co they coached a lot of players that play similar to me and have the same type of game I got, and they know what I need to do and what, and what I don't need to do. So basically, it's just told me this year and just be a leader and just do everything. So I got to live up to that. Well, we appreciate the time for both of you. We're looking forward to uh, watching the two of you out on the court together once again.